And then over the next decade, let's say 2035, what transformations do you foresee shaping the trajectory of India? There are many aspects to it, but on the technology side, I think how one of the big challenges is we have, you know, three, four hundred million people who use smartphones, who use UPI and all that. How do we take it to a billion people? And that's where the work done by Mitesh, etc. is very important because that's about allowing a billion people to communicate with the computer in their own language to get work done. Democratization of access will truly happen when the language thing is done. The second thing is, how can we finally crack the learning issue? I think uh, as Roni wrote recently about the ASA report, after two decades, you're seeing some progress, but if you can accelerate that progress and more young Indians are educated, then it's, it's a big deal. I think the entrepreneurial explosion is just beginning. India went from a thousand startups in 2016 to 150,000 startups today, and that's just going to keep growing. And then they will use a lot of this mass scale technology we are deployed in very, very interesting use cases. You saw that today. And then there's going to be a lot of you know capital coming in. So I think it's going to be a, a very exciting and interesting time, and India will lead on, on using all these technologies in a positive way.